going over how to wrap a cable. This is the over under wrap, also known as the roadie wrap. We'll get right into it. It's how we wrap all of our cables. Uh, we'll get into it and then I'll explain what the reason is for it, why we do it. Uh, so I'll show two methods. They both wrap it the same way, but people's brains work differently. So we'll do two different styles of doing it and you can pick which one works best for you. So the way that I learned is you want to hold it with your thumb out this way, end of the cable coming out this way on the left side. First wrap is just a regular wrap. So you grab it at the bottom and you just loop, twist it up. Sometimes you kind of got to twist it through your fingers a little bit. That'll give it just your nice loop. And then the second time, you're going to take your hand with the thumb pointed down and your palm away from your body. Grab the cable here and you're going to twist it up like so, and you can see the cable goes underneath this guy, so I'll do it again. So thumb down, palm away from your body, grab it, and then just slowly twist it up. And you wanna to try to keep it even so you got a nice circumference every time you do it. And that's pretty much it. You just alternate doing those. So you go one that goes over, just kind of rolling through your fingers, goes over the top, and then the next one, palm facing down with your thumb down, twist it up so it lands under the, under the cable. And then you just do that a thousand times and you'll get really, really good at it. Cool. So the other way, and I'm doing these both for right-handed folks, so you'll have to uh, like mirror, mirror this and look at it the other way if you're going left-handed. Um, so you're still holding it with your left hand with the cable pointed away from you. And you're gonna do the same thing. You're gonna grab it. The first one's gonna be a loop. Let's see if you can see it. First one's gonna be a loop, just straight up. So it just lands over the top. And then with the next one, you're doing pretty much the same thing, except your wrist is kind of turning in this way. So your wrist will turn in. You see it kind of lands under, the, under itself. That'll come up like that and then even it out so it's all the same circumference. So it's a loop on top, just normal, and then grabbing it, hold it up so you can see, maybe with a couple fingers and you kind of roll it through your fingers and come up like that, like so. And you'll do millions of miles of cable while you're working with tech so you get really good at this. Cool. So the reason we do this is to keep the cable, it theoretically keeps the cable every time you wrap it, it's looping one way and then it's bending back the other way. So it kind of theoretically keeps it straight. The problem if you wrap it like this, just going over and over and over, is the cable starts to keep bending the same way and eventually it'll start to curly cue and it makes it a huge pain to try to throw or to untangle and it can damage all the wires in there and it can degrade the signal. So you've probably seen like extension cords that you've wrapped around your arm too many times, they just get all knotted up or like your iPhone ear pods or something, they get all just demolished. So you can use this to wrap any single cable. It'll keep all your computer cables nice, keep all of our cables nice, and it's the way to do it. So some things you'll run into while you're doing this, sometimes the cable kind of gets a mind of its own and wants to bend a certain way you never want to just like force it in place because it'll fight against you and you'll wind up with this ugly looking mess. So if you want, if it starts fighting you, you kind of grab it, you run it through your hands, you kind of straighten it out, try to get all those little loops out. So you kind of want to unwind those gently and then wrap it and then keep going until you run into another kink. If you start trying to force it or you find that it's like it's all knotted and squirrely looking, that sucks. We don't want to do that. It's not going to unwrap nicely. It's going to damage the cable. So sometimes you got to spend a little extra time to kind of undo it, get it through your fingers and keep it nice and neat. And you'll get real good at that as you do it. So that's the roadie wrap. Practice it, learn it, love it, live it.